When we're talking about putter fitting, the two main questions that I always get asked is what length putter should I get? And also what head configuration would work best for me? So we're going to talk a little bit more about the first piece, what length putter in this video. And we're going to go ahead and just quickly talk about uh, how to look for a head shape that best matches your eye. Okay, so uh, one of the things that I've learned over the years of teaching putting and fitting putters is that it's great starting point for somebody would be getting their pitching wedge and getting them into their full swing posture. Okay, so once they're comfortable in their full swing posture, I'm going to ask them to take and open up the hands and I'm going to go ahead and keep my lead hand right here and I'm going to slide their pitching wedge out of the equation. And then I'm going to have a few different length putters. Okay, without them moving, I'm going to go ahead and slide that putter into their hands. Okay, so that would be the first place that I'm going to go ahead and start. And one of the reasons why I'm going to go ahead and start there is I think that's a pretty good forward bend for putting. Okay, from there I'm going to go ahead and adjust the length okay, in the lie based on where I want their head position to be. Or, be more specific, where their eye position is going to be. Am I going to get them more on top of the golf ball? Am I going to get their eyes a little bit more towards uh, the inside of the golf ball? And all that's going to kind of be determined by is using lasers. We use lasers here, uh, specifically in our Adele putter fitting system. We've put mirrors on the face of the putter. And then we go ahead and we see where the laser is reflecting off of the putter in relation to their target. And one of the things we'll do from there is that's when we'll start to change head shapes We'll start to change hosels, line configurations, and even the length of the putter so that we can go ahead and get where they think they're aimed a little bit more matched up to where they actually are aiming. And then by the time we're done our putter fitting, we have done a really good job of getting those two closer together. So where they believe they're aiming and now with the adjustments to the putter so that it suits their eye or really their subconscious eye, we try to marry the two and then what that's going to do is that dictates now where their true eye position is going to be, where their ball position is going to be. And then we had a good starting point by going with a length of the putter that best matches their pitching with posture. And by the time we're done our one hour setting, we've got golfers in a really good posture. We've got them aiming their putter better. If they can aim their putter better, less compensations are needed to go ahead and get that ball rolling over their intended line at their desired target.